Tell us about it. Is well, our this evening, day I'm only? Um, Hi, happy sweetie. Happy Mother's Day. Why, thank you. And happy Mother's Day to your lovely wife. Yeah, I was just with her having a steak dinner. She's so happy. It oh, was a beautiful nice. night. She's here? Yeah, she is. They oh, came good. to visit. Did you fall asleep by, while you're like... <laughs> no, I was like, you know, this feels so good, but I've got to go back and do one more show. But I'm so happy to be here and share it with all you mums out there. Congratulations to all you mums. You're amazing. And you did some new cookware and a mm -hmm. great new silhouette in your line. So First why did you time create this? we have ever ever shown this product, wow. okay? It was years and years in the making. I'm holding it in my hot little hands. Have a look how beautiful this is. I mean, if you went to one of those specialty stores and you know the type I'm talking about, you'd expect to pay 199 bucks for this one piece. Yeah. It is such a beautiful piece of cookware. It's cast aluminum, so it's not forged, it's not shaped, it's literally heated and poured into the actual shape. So here's what I love about it. Look at that, what's the, what's the length of the pan? Is it 14 inches? The length inches? of the pan comes 14. in. 15 and three quarters 50, of an inch. So see, I'm underrating it again. 15 and three quarters. Look, I'm putting two whole boxes of spaghetti in there, and it fits just perfectly, all laying down to start. So nothing's clearly going to stick to that. Now, we've put the glass domed lid. The reason, and I know you're looking at this and thinking, that might just be the most beautiful piece of cookware I've ever seen in my life. Gorgeous. By the way, you're not wrong. It really is just gorgeous. The thing I love about it is this glass domed lid doesn't have a steam vent by design, okay. right? Because what we want want with this is for all of that condensation to come up to the top and drip back down. Here's the perfect example of what we're talking about. It's the ultimate slow cooker. So when wow. you think of this pot, you don't have to use it like this. You can use it a variety of ways. But look at all of that meatball sauce. Just coming up to the top, nothing's evaporating, right? So you're keeping all the flavor, 100% of it in there. And when you lift oh, the lid, wow. you can see we've got 30 meatballs in here. So I'm going to wait for that spaghetti to 30? cook. 30? 3-0. 3-0 in here. This wow. is the first time we have ever brought this pan out. You're the very first people to see it. Here it is. It just goes beautiful beautifully in the kitchen and even more beautifully on your dining room table. It is a one pot dinner master. You're going to fall in love with it. We've only got a few thousand of these and this is the first time you're seeing it. And, and we, have, we have red or we have black and mm -hmm. it's super important. The price ends in less than an hour. Tick, 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 tick. Right. This is one of those shows where you don't want to goof around because at midnight we launch a new today's special. Mm -hmm. This is a this day only so the price is only good for right, right now. Plus chef, I don't know it's if you noticed, price. four flex pays and explain the interior of someone's brand oh. Oh, of course, sorry. So, of course, this is the Durapan. I mean, yeah, you're looking at this thinking that's a Dutch, a Dutch oven or right, a big right. old casserole. I think it'd be a hot uh, mess to clean up, right? Have a look at this, right? I'm going to lift out my roast beef. Okay. So we've pot roasted that beef, potatoes and onions, and what you're seeing in here is what you know and love from my brand, and that is Durapan. So if you have a look all the way down, in fact, let me go ahead. Rochelle, I'm going to need yes. another bowl because I'm going to use this one sure. for the onions and potatoes. Sure. I want you to actually see this. It's a really good point. Thank you for reminding me. Sure. I'm going to pull that out and then have a look in the pan, right? Now, this just slow roasted beef for an hour and a half. Watch this. You're going to wipe it clean, <laughs> and you've now got nonstick that is ready to go. Again, I could fry eggs on that straight away yeah. if I wanted to. That's done. That's clean. Absolutely it's good to go. Spotless. And so, you can use metal utensils. It is four times yep. more durable than traditional, four times more durable than traditional nonstick, which to me, Chef, as you know, makes your life easy. It's why his nonstick has become the number one best selling nonstick here in the history of HSN. I mean, it is a beef. brilliant nonstick that you will love. And this is the result that you'll be getting, oh, you guys, wow. when you're cooking. So see how that's perfectly. Um, pink on the inside, beautifully crispy and caramelized on the outside, and you'll be getting these results every single time once you get the right, right cookware home. Have a look at that. Hey, um, Chef, and you, have you mm, seen mm, on mm, Pinterest mm. all the stories about one pot cooking? Mm -hmm. It is one of the rages now oh. of get it all done in one pot, and why do you think it is? Mm. <laughs> I'm so sorry. That just tastes, so, have a taste Thank of that. you. Oh my but goodness. I mean, it's easy cooking, right? But we want the vessel to mm -hmm. have easy cleanup. So in this pan... Oh, that's to, insane. Oh, is that, that so that good? Insane, yeah. In this pan, wow. have a look at what we've got. All of this, have a look at what's in front here. Two, what's that? Four, is it four or two? Four cups. Eight cups of beans, mm. six cups of stock, four cups of tomato sauce, two cups of... Um, 
uh, hot hot sauce, and then two packages, so two full pounds of beef, all fits into this pan, right? So we've browned off some of this ground beef, right? And if you're really quick, you can still get your hands on some of that as well. You've Let's, just launched a new food line here. We have, and here it is right here. This is the chili, so this is pre-seasoned ground beef. We've got chili here, we've got bold chipotle. I've done a mix, a pound of each in here, because that works really well too. It's nearly sold out, so if you want some of that, give them a ring, because you might be able to scoop up one of those last packages that they have. We've got four Four cups of beans, so that goes in as well. Then we can throw in the tomato, because when you're looking at this before it all okay, goes in together, you're like, that can't possibly all fit. I didn't think it was going to fit, I'll be really honest pot. with you. No, it doesn't look like it would. I totally understand. <laughs> and look, there's still room to move. <laughs> yeah, that's funny. Right? So you go ahead, you give that a good old stir, and here's where this pot really comes into its own. You drop it in. Oh, don't forget, ever, literally drop it in. Everything <laughs> is 100% trapped inside, so none of that steam escapes from this point on, which means it's not reducing. And that's a great thing if you want to keep all of that flavor in there. So we're just going to bring that up slowly. We'll come back and visit it in just um, a minute. Chef, let me highlight a couple things real quick, because yeah. you've been using a lot of stuff that's available. Sure. The trivet, the trivet, the trivet. Now, yes. you might not know this, but I'm such a nerd. I went online. He has 35 <laughs> customer picks. Look at this. 35 customer picks. This is one of the greatest. And we're down <laughs> to the final 300 of the smartest trivet slash Drain dryer. How many? 300? Dry, 300. Okay, 300. so that's selling out tonight, clearly. Right. And explain just really quickly piece. what you use it for. Okay, so it's made of carbon steel. It's covered in food grade silicon. So it's super, super strong. It rolls up and goes straight over your sink when you want to use it as a dish rack. But it's also a trivet. It can go to 500 degrees. Isn't that crazy? Okay? So you can drop that down. And look, as these meatballs are bubbling away, I can pick that, that up and drop it down there. It's now a perfect sort of security blanket for your countertops and, of course, your dining room okay, table so as well. Of those watch that sell out also if you saw his bear claws that he uses it's another customer pick and they're available they're worth their weight in gold oh, oh my yeah. gosh if you're going to break down some meat or a pot roast or something like it they're pork yeah. oh my gosh if you're fabulous. in a slow cooking you've got to get yeah your hands so on ask that. about those two um we have knives available you have a santuku knife set available you those, can ask about that beautiful utensils that you spoke about at the top of the hour mm -hmm. and this is the beauty of the dura pan see what i'm doing here i'm putting onions and garlic straight into a hot pan with no oil at all i'm going to repeat it. You don't need to use oil or butter ever again when you buy the DuraPan. And if you're looking at me using a stainless steel utensil, you can also do that because you're not going to scratch the pan. That's how hard it is. Then I'm going to pick up my mussels and a few clams as well. Drop that into the pan. You'll see a little wow. bit of that steam rise up. I want a little bit more, so I'm going to add a little white wine because I like the flavor of white wine. <laughs> and then we're going to take the lid, drop that on, and again, you're going to see it engulf with steam really soon. You're going to see little droplets of that condensation that's dripping right back on in. So this is a Dutch oven at its absolute best. It's got those little buffet handles, as you can see. It goes straight from the stovetop right on into the oven. You can see that's already getting steamy and fantastic. Fantastic. Beautiful. We'll come back to that one. Uh, we haven't even shown you putting it in the oven. I mean, if you're going to make right. a beautiful casserole in here or a giant mm -hmm. lasagna if you wanted to or whatever it might be, um, it's going to work in the oven beautifully. Oh, yeah. Now, here's the other thing, too. A lot of people say Dutch oven, best of old world. Yep. Your dura, your dura coating is the best of new world. Absolutely. Um, but they would be concerned on weight. And yes. this is what always amazes me about your cookware. Normally, a Dutch oven weighs a ton. And this is forged aluminum, right? So you know it's heavy. Right? Isn't it heavy? Then why can I hang it from my pinky? Yeah. It is not heavy. We know that the food that you're going to put in here is going to be heavy. So we've purposely made this lightweight out of aluminum. And have a look underneath here. That stainless steel base is where it gets all that beautiful strength. So I can go ahead and I can hang it on a pinky, no problem at all. And then that fits with the lid just perfectly. And I love Thank pointing you. that out because I think a lot of us go, oh, yeah. Dutch oven, six and a half quarts. Right. I'm not going to. No, you can handle it. You can deal with it and you'll love it. All yeah. right, Jim. Let me ask you, feel, Adam, which color is the most limited right now? Because we have two. We have the black and we have the classic red available. I'll give you guys an update in just a second. And just please remember, right. the price is good for right now and only until midnight. So only about 45 minutes. <laughs> if you knew what we were looking at right now, we're looking at a screen that is lit up. You guys are calling in. You're online buying this. We know it. We knew this would happen. Yeah. The product is wonderful. Get the color you want while you can. This is how we do it. We bring just a tiny little amount just to test the waters, just to make sure sure that you're happy with it, get some customer reviews on it, and then we come back and we sell it in a big way. So if you want it for this introduction price, which won't be repeated, please give us a ring and grab it while you can. The beef goes in, I've thrown in some carrots, some mushrooms, some onions, then I go ahead and pour in all that beef stock, 
Oh gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. The lid goes on. Now, this then goes into the oven, right? And I've got one in there that I'm going to pull out and show you exactly how it comes out. It goes in the oven all the way to 400 degrees, which is hotter than you'll probably ever use it, but um, that's okay. It's, gotcha. it's good to know that you've got the, got the option can, if you want right, it. Yeah. Now, the, the trivet that you mentioned before, watch this. It's going down onto my trivet. Let me just sit my... With no worries. With no problems whatsoever. Straight out of the oven, and you're about to see just how hot it is in there. Have a look at this. Oh, Beautiful geez. and steamy, wow. right? <gasps> and oh then my gosh. Another thing you guys, while you're picking up bargains today, have a look at this. This is my lid rest. My hot lid goes on there. So if there's any steam or residue, it runs down the lid and gets captured by the lid rest. Um, this one there. So if the, if the steaminess goes down the lid and gets captured there. Or All drippy right. food or something. Drippy food, exactly. So let's go ahead and have a look at this beef. I've got my bear claws, again, also available for you guys. And this is just to help you pull oh. that beef apart. But have a oh. look at how tender and fantastic the results are going to be for you The saliva that has just been released time. in everybody's <laughs> mouth right now. Oh, my gosh. All you mums out there celebrating Mother's Day, I'm so, so glad that you had a wonderful day. And thank you so much for watching us today we've had really good fun and to bring you a brand new product at the end of it all is just what it's all about That's you know great, yeah. the thing I love so much about this is how you would do this right I would finish this with just a little parsley mm -hmm. okay I'd be doing all this in the kitchen mind you then I would put down my trivet you know you're seeing that beautiful red trivet there I'd walk out to the dinner table I'd say guys dinner's ready I would drop it down and then as they all sit I'd take that lid off and they'd all be like oh my goodness <gasps> are you kidding yeah, me mouth watering you know. mouth watering Absolutely. <laughs> well, and that's the kind of experience we want. The neat thing about this cookware collection that you see, including that 13-piece set, is you will fall in love with it every time you use it. You know, every Chef, there's time. just no doubt about it. I One of the, the workhorses is a couple of my pans that I've picked up from here at HSN from you. And it makes cooking fun and delightful and easy because you know what? You mm -hmm. don't do something ooey and gooey sticky and then right. it has to soak all night and you're facing a dirty pan Monday morning. Right. So for you, right before you go to Who work, you're that? like, really? I gotta scrub a pan? That never happens with this cookware line. If you read the reviews, it is, what's the statistic on your customer picks in your cookware? It's a crazy statistic. I, I can't like remember the off the top of my head. the number one brand. We're the number one brand in all of HSN. So we're like, the highest rated brand across all categories. Like beauty, so not just kitchen, home, beauty, everything. Home, vitamins, you name it. <laughs> right. And we get the best ratings. And we, we thank you for it, by the way. Right. By the way, if you've got the product, give us a ring. Because even if you haven't got this Durapan, which is brand new, this cast sure. aluminum, if you, it's the same interior. It's the exact same non-stick. So if you have a piece of Durapan or any of our products, give us a ring. Let us make you a part of the show. We'd love to hear from you. So have a look Ooh, at this. Look at that. And just, I'm showing this off. I'm obviously deep frying these French fries because I want you to see the capacity and the space that you're getting and able to move these uh, French fries around. It's really, really cool because, you know, you don't want to crowd a fryer. And if you're going to fry in oil like I am right now, whether it's fried chicken or whether it's fish and chips that you want to make, you want to be able to move those chips around a minute and just, like, let them, so let them circulate until right? they're beautifully, beautifully brown. And then... Take them up. Oh my you gosh. know that you're, you're pulling beautiful French fries out of there. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. And if there's you... something about this oval shape that's so appealing. Isn't it beautiful? It really is. I mean, it's been around for centuries, let's face it. It's one of the first shapes that ever sort of became in cookware, for good reason, right? And I'm just going to pull all of these French fries out. <laughs> I hear my, uh, my muscles talking to me over there. <laughs> Um, and when they do, you don't want to leave a muscle waiting. Wait, let me ask you a question real quick, because I know you got to go back. But yeah. how are you retaining that heat so perfectly? How is it built well, to hold that great oil Great question. Heat? Okay, so another... another brilliant property about cast aluminum is it holds temperature really, really well. It, it retains it really fast. Um, it builds it also really quickly. So have a look what we've got over here. Um, be, be, and, and that's a really good part about it. It's the same sort of thing as cast iron. It's made in the exact same way. They heat up the material, they pour it into a mould. It's a slower way to produce cookware, frankly. You know, it's easier to do forge. This is a little bit harder. But the, the results are well worth it, if you right. ask me. Right. Yeah. You know, again, over here I've got these mussels and clams. Now, I'm going to go ahead and hit it with a bunch of fresh parsley, because mm. I just love that. I would serve it directly in this pan. So, yes, I have a bowl right here, and that's what you could do. You could bring it on over. 
but I would bring this, I'd drop it on my trivet, mm -hmm. I'd call people to the dinner table again, and when they got over there, the steam will have built back up in here, right? So it's keeping it really nice and hot, and that heat's coming from that um, cast aluminum. And look at that. You lift in the lid, I'll drop that on my lid rest, and then... Everybody dig in. You know, go for it. <laughs> to show you the volume, just to show you the capacity here, let me go ahead and pour it into my uh, container. It's very deceiving, don't you think, Chef? Oh, yeah. Because at first glance, you don't think it's going to hold very much. Right. Yeah, right, absolutely that's crazy. not. Isn't yeah, that right, so right, beautiful, Rochelle? Rochelle? Yeah. Oh my gosh, so that's all, and again, that's feeding a crowd. You know, that's not just one or two people. Right. That's a crowd, and, it, and not taking up a lot of space. I think it's really interesting because certainly we need stock pots, but stock pots to me are very utilitarian. Look at that. You know, they're just not very pretty. Yeah. I think this really is the sweet spot. Mm -hmm. Lots of capacity, but really beautiful as a presentation. It sure is. Now look, Rochelle went ahead and jumped the gun on us. She pulled out those two boxes. <laughs> the pasta was. Boxes of spaghetti. She's like, I'm not going to let it overcook. That's our dinner. And you're absolutely right, Rochelle. Thank you, my darling. You're so let me lift the lid here and show you the capacity. You're not going to have enough room in that for I all mean, that. I mean, there's absolutely no way. Do we have another container, Rochelle? Because I would love to show yes. um, the, 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 awesome. just how many of these are going to come out. So, you know, look, you might set this up in a buffet with the spaghetti right next to the meatballs. Mm -hmm. But let me bring this up and show it to you. Or, Chef, like you said, serve the meatballs right out of there. You, it's you so sure could. beautiful. You absolutely could. And there's but, something very authentic about a Dutch oven. There's something oh, about yeah. serving out of it, cooking out of it. It'll become one of those wonderful workhorses. And unfortunately, we have to wrap it up. Remember, the price on this is only good for the next, uh, what, 30, 40, 40 minutes. That's it. And then it's going to go up.